Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Corey and I want to show you guys how you can use one computer and effectively uh, share the internet from that one computer using a router to everyone else within your cabin. So in this demonstration, I'm going to be using my MacBook Pro. Um, you can use MacBook Air, you can practically use any Mac. So what we're going to do is we're going to go down here to preferences and sharing. We're going to use internet sharing from Wi-Fi to Ethernet. Now, if your Mac does not have um, an Ethernet adapter, that's fine. You can pick them up off Amazon for less than $20. Um, the one I'm using is full gigabit. So that's why you see right here, it just takes USB. It actually has a three port hub on it. It has an Ethernet adapter connection at the end, which goes into this router. Um, now, you could additionally, if you wanted to, buy a secondary wireless adapter and just do it plain and simple right from your laptop to share your connection. So you'd use a, wire, a separate wireless adapter and you'd say internet sharing from Wi-Fi to the other wireless adapter that you plug in that's supported on Mac. But this little thing right here, um, this is a CradlePoint MBR-19. And this thing is a 3G slash 4G ton of other th options. So right now I'm using the Ethernet to grab the Wi-Fi from my Mac. However, if I were to unplug it and turn on this hotspot right here, um, then it would connect to that. Or similarly, if I turned on my phone over here, then it would connect to that and use that as the connection. So taking the Wi-Fi and doing that. Now the reason why I'm using the laptop for this demonstration is because you have to physically sign on to the network. So you won't be able to sign on with this. It won't pop up a page saying you need to authenticate. So that's why I'm just making it simple and using this. I could spoof the MAC address onto this, which is just changing the MAC address. It's not like, don't think of spoof as a bad term. It could be used maliciously, but for this demonstration, it's fine. Just put the MAC address on here. The thing would be authenticated and that would be the end of it. Uh, but instead, I decided just do it this way. So this way, if I wanted to, I could just take this off and just have me using it if I needed faster connection, uh, whatever the case might be. So I hope this helps you guys out. Uh, there are similar programs like Connectify on Windows. Again, they all will need a secondary wireless adapter or um, Ethernet, and that's about it. So make sure you have those requirements. I'm sure you can figure something out how to share internet from one connection. Um, I'm sure there's plenty of guides on this, but I was just telling you about how I'm doing this on the Carnival Pride. This has worked on the Celebrity Summit and Carnival Splendor as well. So I hope this helps you guys out. I'll see you guys in the next video.